are some inspirational images to kickstart your weekend. It is, in fact, a very inspirational Friday. Why? Because we're about to turn our focus to a truly remarkable journey and a story that culminated last week. Now, on Tuesday last week, 58-year-old Theodore Yach achieved something truly spectacular. He spent three hours and 10 minutes in 13 to 14 degree water attempting and completing his 100th Robben Island crossing. And we are now joined by Theodore and Rob Lowe, Springbok legend um, and one of South Africa's favorite sons. Great to have you guys here. Thank you. I'm going to say it straight out. Sucker for punishments. What on earth is going through your mind? Talk us through this 100th swim. You've got to be pretty chuffed. Um, yes, I think the, uh, the reality is we keep doing it because we want to beat the cold. So for those that don't... <laughs> did cold. you feel like you did it? Yeah. <laughs> so for those that don't, that, that, that don't know, we, we swim without wetsuits. And uh, the 80% the of the challenge is in fact beating the cold. And then the rest is is, is uh, dealing with elements, uh, currents, uh, sometimes the odd, the odd fish. <laughs> That's what would, would have been my first red flag. <laughs> and yeah. and uh, then the, the distance, which, is, uh, w which sometimes can be daunting. Wow. Once yes, twice yes, a hundred times speaks of a deeper calling. First of all, what is the distance? So the distance that I swam uh, last Tuesday was uh, is 10.4 kilometers as the crow flies, but we're not crows. <laughs> so you've got to um, count. You've got to uh, cater for the current. So you're swimming about 12, 13 kilometers, uh, and actually it's all my wife Michelle's fault. Uh, I met her a week before my first crossing, and uh, so I'm still trying to impress her. <laughs> and don't ever stop, my friend. Rob, we know that we've seen through your own incredible journey, you've championed a lot of causes. This is something that, that you've really put yourself out there. And I'm, I would imagine a lot of people come to you wanting you to be a patron of their cause. Why this? Why Theodore? Well, well we, I mean, <laughs> I mean, school days, you know, you know, you know we come through like you know, well, many years together. Um, well, they were both at school together at Weinberg Boys High. Oh, cool! And, and his brother was in class with me at Weinberg, um, and uh, and we, we just had had this affinity. And and I've I've watched obviously I've watched with interest uh, you know, the whole journey which he's had, and uh, it's just unbelievable, incredible what what, what he's achieved. And, and how much I, interest? How, how close is Rob to I, attempting a crossing? I mean, <laughs> <laughs> no, no, look, I'm a surfer. I'm, when, I, when I go above, above the water, I, I've always watched from the top. But I mean, it's just incredible what what's been achieved. I don't think. I don't think there'll ever be anybody to, you know, that'll achieve as, as, it, as really his, yeah, his dream in the making. And well, I'm the funny thing is, every time anyone's spoken about it this morning, they've done a double take. Is that right? Is this really a <laughs> yeah. hundred crossings? Obviously, yeah. you, you do have a deeper calling. You've used this opportunity yeah. to gather funds. What was the, the deeper drive? Um, yes, the, the, the deeper drive is there are a couple of things. Uh, conservation. Um, humans kill a hundred million sharks a year. Um, and obviously, uh, that, you know, that's a tragedy. We, we're fishing out the sea. So that's a critical, a critical element. Um, and then also with the rise of social media, media in the last 10 years, the opportunity to raise an obscene amount of funds for charities uh, has arisen. And so far, we, we, we're over the 6 million rand mark. Wow. Uh, for amazing. this particular swim, we, 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 we've raised approximately uh, 200,000 rand so far. And we're hoping for some from large private donors to come on board in the coming weeks. So that, that, that's a major driver. That is absolutely incredible. Now, Rob, I think you cottoned onto the power of social media a while ago. I follow a lot <laughs> of your, <laughs> your, your, your social media accounts. No, but it's awesome. And you yeah. really do yeah. kind of show a different side to South African life. You've yeah. worked with some of and played alongside some of the greatest yeah. sportsmen that have come out of this country yeah. globally, I think. What is it about this man that inspires you? Well, it's, it's just, just incredible what, what, what's been achieved through, through, through well, uh, you know, so minor sport, and I yeah. call it a minor sport, For but sure. it's actually, you know, if you think yeah. about I mean, the Olympic Games and, and, the, and the gold medals that have been won, it's actually a major sport in South Africa. Yeah, completely, But, it, yeah. but it's, it's, it's pushed it down as a, a, a minor sport, and I'm just, it's just special what's been achieved. I mean, I, I tweeted immediately uh, from Slobai because I couldn't get back, um, <laughs> and I tweeted and raked. I mean, Rake Nettling immediately tweeted, and it was just great to see the, the, the whole chain of, of events and, and, and the support that w which he had. And, and I mean, I, before the time, uh, said to him, because I knew his dad very well, and his dad was a big inspiration to Thea, I think. Eh? I mean, he was, he was a, a South African, uh, he was a Springbok, uh, well, in the water polo player. 
And I, I said to him, your dad will be watching, and, and I'm sure he was watching. He'd be very proud of what he, what he achieved, most certainly. And just special, really incredible what he's done. This is mind-blowing. I think it's actually starting to dawn on me what you've <laughs> actually achieved here, Rob. Thank you so much for throwing yeah. your voice behind this, Theodore. Yeah. Congratulations, sir. Here's to the next Thanks, 100. Next 100. <laughs> <laughs> Truly <laughs> inspirational stuff. You can let us know on our social media feeds what you think of this incredible feat. A hundred times between Cape Town and Robben Island. That is amazing.